decades after uh, we as a planet started raising the alarm about the sustainability crisis that was impending, we do finally agree globally um, on the state of science. We agree that the planet has now been warmed by 1.2 degrees centigrade. We agree on the implications that's going to have all over the world. And that is not a small thing. Uh, we agree on almost nothing on this planet right now. Uh, and the fact that we've gotten through climate denialism is a very important win for science in an environment of growing fake news and disinformation. That's the positive. The negative is we are about to have the most important global summit on the most important global issue that is confronting us. And it is largely going to kick the can. The Chinese won't be there. The Russians won't be there. The Americans will show up without successful legislation. That is the reality. Now, that reality in an environment of global citizens, 8 billion global citizens that have to live on this planet, means that we need to find leadership where it is and not pretend that it exists where it isn't. And that's the purpose of what Ninami-san and I are trying to do with the Sustainability Summit. We, we know that the part of the world that is going to be the biggest swing on all of these issues is Asia. And they must be further engaged. They must be pulled, they must be pushed. And they must be not just governments where there is still enormous mistrust in some areas that mistrust is growing, but also the private sector and also individuals who do care, they are engaged, and they are prepared to provide leadership. I mean, if the cop, session, if the cop process after 27 years now starts to fall apart, that doesn't tell me that we're failing to respond on climate, that tells me that the process is increasingly not going to be driven by a bunch of older male leaders on the global stage. And instead, it's going to be driven by a lot of other people that don't necessarily look like them, but nonetheless share this planet. That's where we're headed. Uh, and, uh, and that's what I hope this uh, summit is, is going to be very much a part of.